If you've been following along the last couple of weeks, you know I tested out the Gorilla duct tape and the clear Gorilla tape on the bottom of my Old Town Predator MX and on my daughter's Ocean Kayak Trident 11. Well, we noticed the other day when we went in, uh, tested out the Trident 11, that clear stuff really didn't work that well. Uh, so now let's take a look at how it came out on the MX with that black Gorilla Tape. So far, a quick glance at it, it looked like it held up a whole lot more than the clear stuff, but again, all I did in this case was simply lay it on and put it on really tight with a spoon, but I know some people do other techniques like uh, use a heat gun to apply it to get it to bond a little bit better. So let's flip this puppy over and uh, see if it held up halfway decent. So yesterday, Lila and I hit the Susquehanna, worked around the shoreline a bit, got stuck on a few gravel bars and all that good stuff. Honestly, this stuff really works. Looking at it here, a few little gouges and stuff taken out of it, little small ones, but for the most part, that stuff stuck on there really, really well. And it's only, uh, you know, it's kind of through there, a couple little spots. But overall, that stuff held up really, really well. I'm totally, totally impressed. Again, I didn't use a heat gun to apply it or anything. I just stuck it on there and took a spoon and pushed it on. Uh, Try to get all the air bubbles and get it to get a good contact. But uh, you see the little spots in there like there? That would have put a little bit of working into the hull. Here's where he's got some scuff, but it can go through. Here's where I drifted backwards a little bit. Anyhow, I'd say that's a serious success. So if you want a really uh, inexpensive keel guard option, I'd highly recommend the uh, black Gorilla Tape uh, over the clear plastic stuff. That stuff definitely works. Uh, let's see how it holds up compared to uh, that... Uh, that proprietary keel guard type of material, but a uh, few little spots on it, but some wear and tear the hole didn't get. Anywho, check it out. Let us know what you think. Uh, try it yourself. Give us some feedback. Thanks for watching Fish Yacker. Like we always ask you, be sure to subscribe to the Fish Yacker YouTube channel. Like us on Facebook, and we'll catch you on the water. FishYacker.com, the original kayak rigging video series.